Hello and welcome to the Whirly Bloke channel. Today I'm going to show you how to do a factory reset on your Mavic Pro. So you decided to sell your Mavic Pro and there's one really simple but very important thing you need to do before handing it over to a new owner. You need to do a factory reset. Now you may not have remembered but when you got your Mavic part of the setup was to activate it against your DJI account and you did this using the app on your phone or your iPad. Now whether you agree with having to do all this very Apple like stuff is up to you but DJI have made this a pretty slick process these days. But when you move your Mavic on, you need to deactivate or unregister it from your DJI account and remove your settings. And that way, the new owner gets to activate it against their account. And this is no different to selling a phone, tablet, or a computer, really. Now, you can't do this using the app. You need to use the DJI Assistant, a desktop app you'll need to download from DJI. To get the software, you need to go to the download center at the DJI website. I'll leave a link below and you need to come down here. You can either download the Assistant 2, which is a slightly older version, which has no updates anymore, or just grab the Assistant 2 for Mavic and download whichever version is appropriate to you, either Mac or Windows. I've already got it installed on my machine. So get this fired up, you will need to log in. So now you've got the assistant running, you will need to connect your Mavic to your computer using a USB lead with a micro USB. Now we're going to need to turn the Mavic on and because I'm uber cautious doing this sort of thing on the bench I always like to remove the props first just in case. I've never had an issue. But... Now the micro USB is on the opposite side to the SD card slot, just here. Okay, that's plugged in. And turn your Mavic on and wait for the icon to appear in the app. There we go. So you can double click on this guy. So now you're connected to your Mavic and you are logged in to the assistant. This list here will show you all the firmware versions that are available. It allows you to upgrade and downgrade. I don't have a network connection at the moment, that's why this list is empty. So if you've played with this before, you'll know what's in here, but if you haven't, it allows you to upload data to DJI if you have some issue. It allows you to access flight data. That's stored on the SD card. Um, there's a black box. allows you to calibrate various things. There's a simulator and some Wi-Fi settings. But we want to go to the firmware update page. There we go. So all we need to do is hit restore factory defaults. Yes, we want to do that. So hopefully this is removing the link to your DJI account and all the private data that you've collected. But I'm sure DJI do actually store some stuff. You know how it goes. That's complete. There we go. All done. So now you can turn your Mavic off. So that's it. Your Mavic is back to factory settings and disconnected from your DJI account. And hopefully it's removed any private data DJI capture while you're flying. And despite some digging around, it's unclear if all your private data is cleared, but I'm sure DJI hang on to some of it. So now you can pack up your Mavic and it's ready to hand over to its new owner. Now if you found that useful, give me a thumbs up and leave a comment. And if it's your first visit to the channel, then subscribe for updates. And I pretty much try and get a video out every couple of weeks. I'll see you next time.